the owl. I have four children. Naughty and greedy are my two sons and Goldilocks is my pretty little daughter. And of course, Pat, the baby rat who also lives with us, is my son now. He is a very good boy and he listens to everything I say. See, I got a lollipop. Where did you get this from? When coming back from the park, a very nice uncle gave me this. He said I was a sweet girl and he then gave me this lollipop. I am glad you did not eat it right there. Never accept anything from somebody you do not know. Listen, let me tell you a story about how you should not trust strangers no matter how sweetly they behave with you. There was a louse that lived in the bedroom of a mighty king. She lived in the corner of the bedsheet which was spread over the king's bed set. Every night she would sip the king's blood and then go back again and hide herself. One day a bed bug came into the king's room. The louse was very angry. She asked the bug to go away as this room was hers. The bed bug was very clever. She spoke very sweetly to the louse. She asked the louse if she could please be her guest tonight since she had nowhere else to live. The louse got carried away by the bug's sweet behavior and let her stay in the bed. So though the louse gave the bug shelter, she mentioned that she should not under any circumstance, suck the king's blood. The bug very sweetly said that since she was a guest in the house, she should be given some food to eat. The louse got carried away once again, so she said to the bug that she must be very careful while sucking the blood out of the king's body. He should not get hurt in any way. That night, when the king went to sleep, the bug forgot all about her promise to the louse and she sucked the king's blood really hard. The king felt itchy and woke up. He asked his servants to find the bug and kill it. The servants, instead of finding the bug, found the louse and killed it. So Goldilocks, you should not have taken that from the man. You do not know him. You should never trust strangers. Sorry, Mom. It will never happen again. Good. The same goes for all of you. Now let us go and have some dinner. Yes, it's dinner time. Can we please have your delicious pancakes? And I am going to eat you up. I'm kidding, of course. <laughs> Pootie's bag of goodies